hello, and welcome to the 2016 Hungry Games, coming to you live from Switzerland. I'm Victor Pepper, and it's a lovely day here in the Swiss Alps, the perfect setting for the 7th Annual Hungry Games. This year's contestants are in it to win it, and boy do they look hungry. Let's meet the contestants now, shall we? First we have Megan from Montana. Freddie from Fresno, Violet from Venezuela, and Nick from Norway. Look at that determination, folks. These are the top competitive eaters in the world, and they have all gathered to participate in the Hungry Games. Today, our contestants must eat 30 hot dogs, 3 pizzas, 5 bowls of spaghetti, 4 slices of chocolate cake, and 10 blocks of Swiss cheese. Wow! That sound means it's time to start the competition. The contestants are getting on their marks. Get set and go! Wow, folks, that was truly spectacular to watch. Did you see all of that food flying through the air? <sighs> I love my job. Wait a minute, I'm getting the results from the judges. And it appears we do indeed have a winner. And the winner is, drumroll please, Freddy from Fresno! Hey, Freddy, I am so happy to talk to you. How does it feel to be the 2016 Hungry Games champion? Well, I, I like to eat, so... I bet it feels great. All that training finally paid off, huh? I guess so. Freddy, 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 I'm, easy. I'm, I'm sorry. It's sometimes really hard to turn off that beast mode. Yeah, I'll bet. Wow, you really stuffed your face there, huh? Yeah, but... I think I ate too much. Man, I'll say, Freddy, how do you feel about your victory today? I think I'm gonna be sick. Oh, oh, oh. Wow, folks, it seems as if Freddy has eaten too much food too fast. And it looks like he's dealing with a serious tummy ache. Let's see. Megan, Megan, you got second place in the competition. What was your strategy to make it to the top? Um, I ate a lot of fruit very fast. Wow, folks, look at that strategy. Were you concerned about your other competitors? They seem not to eat as much food as you and Freddy. You just keep eat, a, eating mouthful after mouthful. Oh, sorry about that. Old habits die hard. Um, Victor? I don't feel so well. Oh. oh no. This competition has taken a very interesting turn. Both Freddy and Megan have gotten sick from eating too much food way too fast. Drama, folks. Sheer drama. Let's talk to the other two remaining contestants to get their thoughts. Nick and Violet. I noticed you guys didn't eat all of your food. You have plenty of food left over. Why did you stop eating? Don't you want to win the 2016 Hunger Games? Yeah, Victor, we did want to win. I mean, everyone wants the fame and glory that comes with being a competitive eating winner. Uh, yeah, but we knew that there was just way too much food for us to eat. Sometimes you just have to know when to stop, you know? Yeah, that's right. You know, too much of a good thing can be a bad thing. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't get it. I wish I could eat three pizzas for dinner. I love pizza. Here, check this out. You couldn't even eat this slice? 
and it has a cheesy stuffed crust. Mmm, stuffed crust. Well, all of that stuff is good, but if we were to eat all of it, it would make us sick. Now, you have to know when to stop, and you have to learn how to show self-control. God says in Proverbs 25, 16, if you find honey, eat just enough. If you eat too much of it, then you will throw up. You can't have too much of a good thing. You need to know when to stop. When we aren't able to show self-control and stop what we're doing, we might end up with too much of something, and having too much can cause us harm. Thrilling fans, know when to stop. It's in the Bible. Well, fans, we have learned a lot today. Sometimes we are going to have to show a little self-control, and sometimes that means taking the time to stop. We don't want to have too much of a good thing because it can make us sick or frustrated. Now, I'm going to show a little self-control by having only one slice of that delicious stuffed crust pizza instead of eating the whole thing. I love my joke. Well, fans, it has been a truly shocking day here at the Hunger Games in Switzerland. Or should I say, Swiss Cheeseland. <laughs> I'm Victor Pepper, signing off.